It's early evening and the sun is very much on one side of my face with the other side of my face in shadow. This is not ideal, but there is a solution to it. The side of my face that was in shadow now is getting a little bit of light because I am using a specific tool to help with that. This is a clamshell reflector from eMart. I'm going to talk about it and show you the assembly coming up on Thrifty AV. The eMark clamshell light reflector that's behind me has already been assembled, so let's back up and take a look at that assembly. Here is a rather big box. This is an eMark clamshell light reflector. It has pieces in this bag here. Let's see what we got here. These look like they might snap into each other. That's obviously the reflector. And this has Velcro on it. This may be a different type of reflector. Connect the ends of the two and three curved rod. So some of these rods have these little snaps on both sides and some of them have a, a hole on one side and this plastic piece plugged into the other side that it's just a matter of snapping it in like so. And now I have one long curved piece here. Do the same for this other one. Put the mounted curved rod in the reflector cloth and there's a place to insert this. It does tend to hang a little bit where these buttons are. Also, you kind of got to push it through right there in the middle of the reflector. Now I'm going to do it on the bottom. Install and tighten the support rods one at both ends. Okay, this support rod goes through this sleeve here. And then I got to pull it up to this hole and put it through these holes here and here. It's the same procedure for the left and right side. This reflector is starting to look right. Now I got to mount that bar to the back so I can mount this on a tripod. Connect the crossbar to the light stand. Now some light stands are very affordable, but you want something kind of heavy duty with this because it is heavy and the wind can blow it over. So you want something that's pretty sturdy and maybe that you can put sandbags on the legs to keep it in place. Emart has added a listing for a version of this product with a tripod stand. I will include an Amazon affiliate link for both versions in the description. All right, I mounted the reflector on this light stand and this allows it to pivot. And of course you can raise and lower the light stand for the reflector. Change reflective color with Velcro. Now there is a piece here that attaches with Velcro with two other options. On this side, you're gonna get more of a golden glow, something a little bit warmer than the natural light is. And this side, you're going to get a white instead of a glossy reflective surface. These attach, either side of this attaches with Velcro. Real easy to put up. I put up this warmer reflective surface in a matter of seconds. Now it's not perfect. I could get the creases out of here if I put a little more time and effort into it but it will definitely reflect light. 
Let's take another look at the before and after outdoor shoot. On the left, you see the shot without the reflector. On the right, you can see the shot using the E-Mark clamshell reflector, and you can really tell the difference on the shadowed side of my face. I will definitely be using the E-Mark clamshell light reflector on all of my outdoor shoots from now on. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. Thank you to my patrons for supporting this channel. And remember, stay thrifty, everyone.